identifying the tallest and shortest objects. Children, in the previous video, we learned to identify taller and shorter objects between two objects. In this video, we will identify the tallest and the shortest of three objects. Today, Pinky and Chotu are coming back from school together. Chotu, just see, these buildings are so tall. Yes, Pinky, look how tall this yellow building is. Yes, Chotu, look, this blue building is even taller than the yellow. Yes, Pinky, this blue building is taller than the yellow building. Hey, Chotu, just look, this glass building is taller than these two. Yes, Pinky, that glass house is the tallest among all these houses. So, this means that the yellow house is the shortest of the three houses. So, can you see children? Yellow house is the shortest and the glass house is the tallest of all the three houses. After going a while, Pinky and Chotu passed by Sonu's house. They saw Sonu playing with blocks in the courtyard of his house. Sonu is building a house with his blocks. Come on, Chotu. Let's join Sonu. Pinky and Chotu went to Sonu. Three friends started building different houses using the blocks. Sonu, Pinky and Chotu's block houses are ready. So children, can you tell me who has made the tallest block house? You are right children. Pinky's block house is the tallest among these three houses. Children, can you tell me whose block house is the shortest of all? Yes, Chotu's block house is the shortest of these three. Could you guess the correct answer children? This shows that out of these three houses, Pinky's house is the tallest and Chotu's house is the shortest. So children, in this video, we learned to identify the tallest and the shortest of three given objects. In the next video, we will see examples of identifying the tall and short objects. Until then, bye children.